Hello, Tanya. Hello. Here I am. It's Tanya Tate. I'm in London. I'm outside the Forbidden Planet store in Shaftesbury Avenue. Forbiddenplanet.com. There you go. I'm just letting you know. So today I'm coming down. I've been told there's some really cool stuff. There's going to be comic stuff here and there's Hammer Horror. So I'm going to go in and take a look. And actually, guess who? Guess who's doing the camera? <laughs> Hello, everyone. Tanya, tell them who I am. That's Rich, and he's from Bleeding Cool. You know, Bleeding Cool, like where he puts all the superhero stuff. Bleedingcool.com. Actually, you put some stuff up for me, didn't you? I have. I have put some stuff up about you. Well, you will keep dressing in these superheroine <laughs> costumes, and people will take keep taking your photo, and I will keep finding an excuse to put them on Bleedingcool.com. It's true. It's true. I like it. I dressed up as Emma Frost, so that was really cool, and also Invisible Woman. So um. Still trying to work out which one's going to be my next one. Actually, I'm, I'm like that over whether it should be electric. Electro. Well, maybe we'll uh, see what we can find um, in the store today. We might have some ideas. I mean, there's Spider-Man. It <laughs> quite, covers quite a lot of skin, so it might not be quite what you're going for. This seems quite popular, fellow. Let's go. <laughs> That's a lot of statues. Because sometimes. There what you really, really want. Oh, Batman yeah, I mean, some people like classic art in their homes. Some people really want to have Michael Keaton as Batman as a statue. That would be quite hot. It's quite pretty. Wonder Woman. She doesn't seem to have much in the leg department. That's true. No, I, I, I have got legs today. Absolutely. So being a, a kind of a Mer Wonder Woman thing might not be exactly what you're looking for. Oh, Green Lantern. Size of it? Yeah, very popular at the moment. It's got, it's got a little filmy thing coming out. Big this summer, boss. you won't be able to avoid that man. Uh, oh. And, and it, Power Girl has, you know, has certain attributes. I'm looking at this Power Girl one. Actually, I'm wondering. I don't know. Could I be Power Girl? Do you think? You you might need a little support, but um, she certainly has some. God, she's. Has she got muscles going on there as oh, yeah. well? Oh yeah. I do go to the gym, but I don't think my muscles are as big as theirs. <laughs> Let's wander on. Let's go and have a look. Now, you were looking for a t shirt, weren't you? Yeah. Um, I'm a horror stuff, where is it? <laughs> Very handy. I think you'll. Uh, I think you got what you're looking for around here? Definitely, I think. Oh, there's some... Oh, this is what I'm looking for. For the vampire in your life? <laughs> for the vampire in my life. I'm going to have to get this Dracula t-shirt. How cool is that? Uh, it's Peter Cushing there, who played on the Hammer Horror films. Fantastic, fantastic I, lo I love Peter Cushing. He's on all the old movies. Oh, yeah. He used to watch, like, stuff like Tales of Unexpected. And <laughs> like, all the Hammer Horror. And he was, he was always in... That kind of stuff. Absolutely, and then he looked at things like Star Wars and things and um, Lord of the Rings for people that know from now, but yeah, absolutely. Perfect, I think I'm going to get this one. Definitely. Oh, um, that was Christopher Lee. Anyway, never mind. There's a few. Oh, look at this. <laughs> the curse of Frankenstein. Do you feel particularly cursed at the moment? <laughs> um, looking at that, I feel a bit cursed. I don't know, it better be a good curse that's on me. Well, yeah, it brings you back to life. There's some something good there I guess possibly not in the state you'd want to be no I'd rather be like the, I'd rather be one of them pretty heroin ones you know as opposed to I think you probably chose well absolutely yeah right okay that's good and there's a lot of this kind of stuff here I mean we're looking for lots of t-shirts and mm. the toys and an actual Chucky doll oh no I hate you know, Chucky I go. hate Chucky seriously I am petrified of Chucky I mean, there's quite a few the the public things, because there's the saw stuff going on there. You're not I, a fan, I, are you? No, I, no. Listen, I went to one of the comic cons, and there was the pig from Saw, and he come at me, and he was like that with his knives. <laughs> I was when I was dressed as Invisible Woman. I was like, ah. Yeah, that would have been a little bit scary, even if you weren't dressed as Invisible Woman. I think. Just, yeah. Just in general. Just a pig with swords. Absolutely. What else have we and got? We, well, there's a lot of alien. There's a lot of predator. These are the these are the films, the toys, and the kind. I keep coming back. Because they're just, it's just the, the 80s icon size, and now it's making all the new films now as well. So there's Alien vs Predator, and then anything else they can throw into the mix. So yes, they just I, keep them rolling, keep exactly. them rolling. Exactly. I'd done a movie, it was Power Girls for Television X, and I was dressed in like a Predator kind of outfit. That was pretty hot. And I was like, a, I was like a, this like queen, 
and I had to go and kidnap the best of the species, a very well endowed guy, might I add, and take him back to my spaceship and test him out. I have to say, the aliens and predators in the films, they're not quite as hot. I have to say, that the face is not quite what you'd be expecting, although they do have quite good cleavage. Well, I did take my, like, this big helmet off and, like, throw my hair kind of thing, like... And did it work? Tough. Yes. <laughs> Alright, let's keep going. I'm just gonna film you. Just if you want to walk to the store, I'm just gonna kind of film as get some like in store shots. Because it is quite a cool and you do pick up Yay. lovely bits and pieces. Uh, here we are. This is. Um, is there a Superman. I'm looking at her. Who's she? Um, um, that's Huntress. Yeah, she's a little bit. Oh, hang on. Sorry. No, no, no. Sorry. That's sorry. Black Canary. Black, Black Canary. Ends. I couldn't work it out then. She's normally she's just got the slightly fishnets. different. She's got the jacket on. I don't recognise. Yeah. Nice. Heavy on the fishnet. Exactly. Um, what, what's your take on fishnets? I do like fishnets. There you go. And quite handy for catching fish. At the same time, it's like multi-purpose. Well, I don't know. I've never caught fish with fishnets. I just tend to put my legs in them and be you, very you, You've never lived, you've never lived. We go out. <laughs> uh, uh, Doctor Who, I mean, Doctor look, we've been full of very, very Lots and lots and lots of Doctor Who and all Doctor the Doctors. Who's? How many Doctor Who's? Um, well, officially well, there's about 11 of them. Uh, yes, we've gone to about 11 at the moment, but uh, the new fella with the big chin. <laughs> he's a bit, bit, too, bit too young, possibly. He's a little bit too young. He's a bit of a young Doctor. You might like that. I don't know. He's a little bit young. I like younger doctors. He's younger than me. He's not fair. Doctors should always be younger than me. That was always the way. It's where, are not we, like... where are we going now? We can head downstairs towards the comics. Um, oh, let's get you with. A... Can I try any masks? Oh. I mean, this oh, is. Yeah, well, this is Viva Neta. This is the. This... Oh, this Put is it on. Put that on. You're an anarchist. I'm an anarchist. Give it a try. See, see how it suits on. you. Is it going to suit me? Are you trying to talk me into getting something for. I'm, I'm, one trying, of my to get, comic I'm trying to get you into anarchy. Really. <laughs> Obviously, that's my. I don't know. That kind of works. I think you're now ready to bring down the state. In a kind of hot fashion. But you know, you got the. Uh, I Star prefer Wars sexy things, you know, like skimpy ah. outfits and superheroes. Well that's, well, that's got a little bit of a gim it's, gimpness it's, about it. It's, it's vaguely gimpy. Gimp, yeah. Do you know what? I'd rather put this on someone else, dress them up, and kind of be more of a cat woman and get my whip out. Well, yes, there's, there's plenty of that here. Yeah. And of course, uh, and, and, th and this is the uh, Angry Bird. I mean, that's the sexiest thing in the store. I mean, oh, he's hot. That's cute. I like that one. And oh dear, we just dropped the mask. I'm wrecking the joint. You have to pay for it. Can you take Do you they Yes, absolutely noticed. <laughs> they don't mind though. You, you, can, you can probably get away with most things, I'm guessing. <laughs> oh, hello kitty. How cute. Have you ever dressed up as Hello Kitty? No, I haven't actually. I would look cute as Hello Kitty, don't you think? I think so. I remember there's a little bit of a scandal a few years ago when um, they put out this kind of like Hello Kitty neck massager and it clearly yeah. wasn't a neck massager. It really, really wasn't. I've got one of them but it's not a Hello Kitty and it's not really a neck massager. There we go. Okay, downstairs, here we are with kind of comics and DVDs and books and, and mostly kind of comics, oh, if you want to hear. I might have to take one of these back. It's a little souvenir. Yeah? Yeah, for Bin Planet. Oh, and there's guide. Mr. Bin Planet London Store Guide. Absolutely, I mean, this is the kind of shop that has its own little guide. You know, that's yeah, how big it that's is. That's how big it is? Yeah. Wow. Oh, look at all these books. And there's a lot oh, of comics. There's some really nice stuff here. Oh, you can't. Some of them will be shrink wrapped. They stop you from opening them. Well, we heard the Film Planet got a new shrink wrap machine today, so clearly they've been uh, so they can't. playing with it. Not not everything, but some things are. And um, ah, Captain Britain, this is one of my favourites from when I was growing up. Old Alan Moore, Alan Davis, Captain Britain's. And it's just mad, odd, weird British strangeness. And when I was about like an eight year old kid, it was just one of the best things <laughs> in the whole world. Here we go, we've got loads here. Have a little flick, see what we can find. Oh, uh, again, so. it's a little bit. Oh no, actually that, that, that looks open. This Wednesday open. comics. This is when you want a big comic book. I like, I, I like big. Oh my goodness. What am I gonna Apparently do size these? does matter when it comes to comics. <laughs> yeah, only when it comes to comics. Oh good, good, good to know. This is a hard bag. It's, it's heavy this. It's heavy. Do you know what? I couldn't big. be taking this one with me on the plane. Oh, it's got Green Lantern in here as well. And oh Superman. yes. He's kind of everywhere. This is DC Comics, and it's from the... The Demon and Catwoman, oh nice. It was a rather good collection. Wonder Woman, Supergirl. And just very, very big pages. And wow. A bit more room to expand. 
Uh, so Tanya, you seem to have found a comic book there. What's this one? Anna Mercury. Anna Mercury is kind of, um, yeah. Hard. Do you know what? I'm looking for some inspiration for my next outfit for Comic Con. I don't know. What do you have like a little flick through. Let's have a look through some of the pages. You'll have to hold. I'm, oh, yeah. You've got no hands left. I'm good. I mean, that would. That's a nice. That would kind of, that would kind of do back it. Back shot. Oh. And also, it would be, um, for change, it might be a little bit warm as well. I mean, it's tight. Yeah, it's it gonna, is uh, tight, isn't it? Indeed, you're not going to feel the breeze. <laughs> I'm trying to get some some action shots there. Yeah, yeah, that should be quite an interesting one. Created by a guy called uh, Warren Ellis for Avatar Comics, and yeah, she's a uh, she seems to keep coming back. back. Yeah, so um, yeah, there's a few other bits and pieces around here. I mean, you were looking, we we're looking at Electra earlier as well. Yeah, where's um, that one gone? Yeah, here we go. Now with you Electra, you know, with Electra, you would <laughs> you would feel the breeze. I think I'd I'm going to feel the breeze with this one. Wow. That actually just looks like shiny red PVC straps. Yes. With, that, with a little strap on it. I think head. it's a bit more like material. It's a little bit like, it's not even PVC. It's a little bit like, more like material. So it's going to be even like colder. shiny. Yeah, yeah, I don't think that's going to give me any coverage. Uh, it looks like she's got some nice thigh high boots going on now, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's fine. I would actually like to see her in the comic book, but where is she? Oh, yeah. She, oh, she, what do you want? She's covered up. They've covered up oh, a little yeah. bit there. Yeah, we're a little bit That's more white there. It's still looking good. It's pretty hot. Is she, but she looks better in red, doesn't she? She does. And in this book, um, they seem to have covered her up a bit. It's like yeah. they've gone against type and... Uh, yeah, we go. We've got a bit... Had a little bit more coverage, which is... Yeah. A, you've got the size. You've got the... Uh, she's a little bit, well, little bit ninja. Just, a little I'm bit just getting the ideas. Marshall. So, yeah. um, do you know what? I think I better go and pay for this stuff now. So I've got my Hulk stuff, my Hammer Horror, and then he's carrying it all. Uh, yeah, well, you know, that's all right, that's all right, that's good. <laughs> that's good, here we go. Um, and we did drop the magnet, didn't we? The magnet's on the floor. I'll go grab it. <laughs> there we are, you see, this This is how helpful Forbidden Planet stuff are. <laughs> Very helpful stuff. Right, so I'm going to go and pay for these now, and um, this will be me for reading on the plane, going back to LA. So. Thanks for watching and thanks for coming around to BiddenPlanet.com. This is Tanya Tate and that's Rich from Lincoln.